Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to help you determine the molecular geometry of ICL2- It is a chemical formula for iodine dichloride ion and to understand its molecular geometry we first need to look at its Lewis structure. So here is the Lewis structure of ICL2- in which iodine atom is in the center and it is forming single bonds with both these chlorine atoms over here and it has three lone pairs of electrons as you can see and there is a minus charge over here a negative charge over here because it is accepting additional electrons to form this kind of structure now whenever you want to determine molecular geometry of any molecule you can use axn notation or the steric number here we are going to use the axn notation we are also going to look at its shape so if you look at its shape it is linear because of these three uh, lone pairs of electrons that are present on the central atom they exert the same kind of forces which results in this linear molecular geometry which is quite evident but to confirm that this is the right uh, molecular geometry for this molecule we are going to use the axn notation now the axn notation for this molecule will be ax2 as there are two chlorine atoms forming bonds with iodine atom and n will be 3 because there are three lone pairs of electrons on this iodine atom uh, either it is axn or axc whatever uh, is fine ax2 e3 would be the uh, notation for this molecule and if you refer to this table you can see the molecules that have ax2 e3 uh, formula are linear and they have 180 degrees of bond angles which is evident for icl2 minus ion as well hence the molecular geometry for icl2 minus is linear and i hope this video helps you to understand that for more such videos on lewis structure molecular geometry polarity of the molecules make sure to subscribe to our channel and thank you for watching